The SQL Access Advisor recommends schema changes to you in order to optimize Oracle data access paths. Remember that schema is kind of a slippery word. A schema refers to a collection of objects that are under a single ownership. Sometimes Oracle users are referred to as schemas. Specifically, that would just be an Oracle user who has the permission to create those objects in the first place. Some examples of schema changes that the Access Advisor might give you are partitioning, maybe for an especially large table. Oracle might recommend that you restructure the table and partition it across different data files. That obviously would have a nice effect on query performance and disk I.O. Materialized views. Recall that a view is essentially a stored query, but a view that's not materialized just stores the SQL itself. A materialized view actually stores data along with it, which is again going to positively affect query performance. Indexes. Now you know that Oracle will create an index when you assign a primary key constraint on a column for one of your tables, that's fine. But there may be other columns that are heavily queried that also should have indexes associated with them, and you may have missed that as a database developer or a database designer. So Oracle can give you targeted suggestions related to indexes and logs for material views, etc. Now, how do you give data to Oracle when you're doing Access Advisor? What are the sources of the workload? It's actually pretty flexible. You can look at the server cache for recently run SQL statements and pass those in. You can create a tuning set. That's probably the most popular way to do Access Advisor. You'd take a bunch of SQL that's related, that's representative of a specific workload, and then Access Advisor takes a look at it holistically, in a sense, and gives you those schema changes where it deems necessary. You can also have Oracle generate a hypothetical workload on selected schemas and tables. Enough talking with the slides. Let's do one more demo, and I'll show you how these tuning advisors work in practice.